Hello guys, welcome back to Techatronics. Hope you are liking the contents uploaded in my channel. So today we are going to discuss about the network issues being faced by the customers while using service providers like Reliance Geo, Parthi Airtel, Vodafone, etc. So what is the network issue? That means if you are trying to place a call to a different party, your phone directly got disconnected. That means it's, it's totally disconnecting, it not, it's not going to some other party. So how can we fix this issue? In most of the cases, what people do is that they directly go and restart your mobile to extract or reinstate the network issues in their SIM card. So that's not a permanent solution. Or others, what, what others do is like they will directly scroll it down, they will switch on the airplane mode so that it will jam all the signals around your phone and again if you are turning off this airplane mode the phone will again manually capture the signals around it so this is how you actually try to fix the issues which is related to your sim while placing the calls or sending the messages to a different party so this is not a permanent fix for the issues which is being faced for networks so how to fix this issue so follow this particular method if you are facing any issues in comparable to any of the sim card which you are using so step one you have to scroll down go to the settings option click on settings once you click on settings you'll get an option called wi-fi and network so in that you can see the sim right so click on that you will go into wi-fi and network where you can find then option called SIM and network. So click on that option SIM and network. So once you click on that, you'll go into the window where you can see all the SIM cards which are active in your phone. So I have dual SIM cards on my phone. One is Airtel and the other one is Geo. So under each SIM cards, I have set multiple priorities. That means if you're going down, you can see the voice call, messaging, mobile data. So all these are set to SIM2. So now listen what happens. So now I'm since I'm if I'm facing any issues with SIM2, what you, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna click on SIM2. So once you click on SIM2, you can also see that what carrier it provides. It is Geo 4G. You first you have to do is you click on SIM2 and deactivate the SIM2 from your mobile. That means if you are deactivating the SIM, what's going to happen here is all the signals which is extracted to your phone by the SIM will go off. So you click on OK. So once you click on OK, it will show that it's deactivating the SIM. So after deactivating the SIM, directly don't activate it again. You have to wait for 5 to 10 seconds in order for the SIM to lose all the signals which is incorporated to your mobile phone. So once it's done, you have to click on SIM2 again, turn on the SIM2, it will start activating. Mm -hmm. So once it start activated, what you have to do next is that you have to make sure that you, are, you have put down certain priorities under SIM2, right? So you have to again do it again. So that means click on here, you can see that the mobile data is being set back to Airtel, right? So you click on here, you set it back to Geo4G. So once after that, you will be able to place calls from your mobile as well as multiple SIM cards if you have in your mobile also. These issues can be fixed by following this particular method. Hope you like this video. If you like this video, please like, comment and subscribe and hit the bell icon if you want to receive more notifications about my channel. Have a great day. Stay safe. Stay healthy.